Hello, good morning, and welcome to the Lakeside Viking News. I'm Sully, and it's Friday, April 2nd. Let's begin with today's brief LHS announcements. DeKalb County School District joins families and organizations across the nation in recognizing the month of April 2021 as National Autism Awareness Month. Autism refers to a range of conditions characterized by challenges with social skills, repetitive behaviors, speech, and nonverbal communication. This is an opportunity to honor children and youth with autism. These students struggle developing peer relationships, so reach out to students with autism at Lakeside, and you will find a friend. Hope everyone enjoys their spring break. As a reminder, April is School Library Month and National Poetry Month. Return any overdue books from Lakeside High School or any of the DeKalb County School to the Media Center. All fines are forgiven. Check out this week's activity on our interactive calendar. Go to Lakeside High School's webpage, click on the Media Center, and click on Interactive Calendar. There are lots of ebooks for you to enjoy. Looking for some exciting things to do during the spring break? Look no more. Go to the Lakeside High School webpage, click on Media Center, and look for the Interactive Calendar. Use your student number to log in to get the most activities. If you are having problems accessing the activities, ask the media staff for assistance. There are lots of fun activities. Virtual spring break trips, books to read, poems to recite, a bookmark contest, and much more. Ms. Motel is one of the special education teachers in the building. She works with students with intellectual disabilities. She is looking for a caring, devoted leadership team for the Best Buddies Club International. This is a chance to build a lasting relationship with one of the students and put together fun activities. If you are interested in joining the leadership team or becoming a club member, please contact Ms. Motel at this email address or stop by room 2205. This is also a great club to conclude on college transcripts. Many colleges have their own Best Buddies Club. AMC Buckhead 6 invites student job seekers to a hiring party April 9th from 3 to 4 p.m. There will be free snacks and drinks. RSVP by sending your first and last name to this email address. You can also apply online at this website. It's time to apply for the Student Government Association. SGA is an organization on Lakeside campus that connects you to the best parts of the high school experience. They plan homecoming, pep rallies, dances, support Black History Month activities, and highlight other fun and exciting things to be a part of at Lakeside and work to make our school the best it can be for all students. If you are passionate about making our school better for everyone, full of school spirit, want to inspire others and be spirited, and you are wanting to work to make next year the best year uh, for our high school, then please apply to be an SGA officer. All applications must be submitted by Wednesday, April 21st at 11.59 p.m. Elections will be conducted virtually on Monday, April 26th at 8 a.m. till Thursday, 29th at 11 p.m. Please see the application for more details about each position as well as the requirements. You can find the application link at Lakeside's Instagram page or at their website here. And now to Deanna with the news. What's up, Lakeside? I'm Deanna and I'm back with Kearney Bank. Four people were killed in a mass shooting at an office complex in Orange, California on Wednesday. The fifth victim was transported to a local hospital in critical condition. The suspect was also transported to the hospital after a shooting with the police. This is around the 20th mass shooting since the Atlanta area spa attacks two weeks ago. Workers at a Baltimore plant manufacturing Johnson & Johnson and AstraZeneca vaccines accidentally ruined about 15 million doses. The mix-up has halted future shipments of Johnson & Johnson doses in the United States while the Food and Drug Administration investigates. It does not affect Johnson & Johnson doses that are currently being delivered and used nationwide. Seven of Hong Kong's pro-democracy leaders were found guilty on Thursday of unauthorized assembly, a verdict seen by their supporters as an assault on the freedom of speech and other civil liberties. They each face up to five years in prison and the sentences will be handled down on April 16th. Hong Kong's authorities have overseen an expansive crackdown on the pro-democracy movement since 2019. More than 2,400 people have been charged as the authorities seek to stop the movement, which has posed the greatest challenge to Beijing's rule in decades. And now to part one of Lakeside's Easter holiday special.
Hey man, long time no see. What you doing? You want to catch up? No, uh, I got I got a few um I got a funeral to go to. Yeah, yeah. My my brother died. You don't have a brother. What did I do? Did did I mess up? Are are you all right? You're kidding, right? You you abducted me, and not once but twice. And you, you want to be friends after that? But, but I got you McDonald's. You Lucas too. You know how much that costs every day? Like a lot. Like three meals every three meals every day. You're unbelievable. Why do you think that conversation went the way it did? Because obviously his taste in cuisine is awful. McDonald's is freaking awesome. That's one opinion, but do you think it perhaps relates back to the kidnappings earlier? Mm, yeah, I think it could be, but I think it's the food thing. And you still haven't apologized? No. What about Luna? What about Luna? Didn't you say sorry to her? Hey, Snookums. It's been a while since I've talked to you. Please, just give me one more chance. Yeah. Yeah. If you're willing to apologize to her, don't you think you could do the same for Lucas and Brayden? That's it for today's Lakeside Viking News. Have a fabulous Friday, an amazing spring break, and please stay safe.